One thing I'm trying to really sort out with the menstrual cycle discussion is if we did know for sure that injury risk was higher in a certain phase, what would we do? Like, would we just do the same thing anyway, strength train year round, focus on nutrition and recovery, or would we pull the girl out of competition during that week? Is that realistic? So that's something I'm trying to sort out. I don't know if you're like wondering about that too, but mm-hmm. I'm, I'm open to hearing what your thoughts are. Yeah, we've had, we've had a few discussions at IMG because we would love to do some education for the staff around it. Um, and then for the girls eventually. Um, but yeah, it is, that is a hard question. I, you wouldn't want to pull them out of competition really. Cause I feel like you, would you ever have a team, you know, cause everyone's not going to be having their periods at the same time. Um, but I think there are certain things that you could do, um, especially like right before they're going to be on their period, you know, we, we might fo- focus more on, um, some injury prevention tactics then. Um, and then when they're on the period, maybe we ump up, amp up the strength and power, um, focus. Um, and again, I think I really would like like readiness questionnaires and stuff with that as well. Cause it, you know, did they sleep well? Were they, you know, were they in a lot of pain? How are they actually feeling today? Um, so I think, I think that all ties into it, but that is such a good question that I feel like there definitely needs to be, you know, more research on that. And, um, I, I, I'm really interested in that. I would love to, to do more and I want to see what I can do here, um, to, to kind of see it is, it is tough too, to, you know, try to have like almost like three different programs that you're going to be doing, um, that you would be, you know, depending on where you are in your cycle. Um, but for, I just really think it's going to be more of like an educational piece and making sure the girls understand what's going on. And if they do, you know, are, are feeling some, something, you know, you're going to know your body more than, than anyone else. Um, I once had an athlete tell me that right before her period that she, her calves would always get really tight. And she's like, could this, could this be something with my menstrual cycle? I was like, could be, uh, you know, if, if that's what you're feeling, like that's something. So maybe, you know, something like that's taken into consideration, but it's just having a conversation with your coach. Um, that's where I hope it gets to and where, you know, we get comfortable having those conversations and then maybe we can tailor a program around that. Um, but I wouldn't want it to be like, uh, oh, you know, you're, you're on your period this week. Here's, here's your program to be like, kind of like called out or anything or like, mm-hmm. but just to be aware of it, like if you need to back off or anything or, or you want to push yourself more, um, just, and we know where you are. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think you're right. I think it can get a little problematic because everyone's so individualized within like you 